Hello, my lovely Leos, and a very warm welcome to your November 2022 horoscope forecast. It's getting intense. We are in the eclipse season. We've got a lunar eclipse coming this month. Saturn and Uranus are getting into a very tight square. This has to do with responsibility, practicality, and at the same time, freedom to break out of structures that no longer work for you. So it's a, it's a fine balance and finding your power, your strength that is inside of you. You are a fixed fire sign. You're one of the strongest signs in the zodiac. And this month gives you the opportunity to really find your power, your spark once again. So on the 8th of the month, we've got this eclipse happening here, lunar eclipse vibrating there in your 10th house along with Uranus. And we've got a big focus this month on the 4th and 10th houses, especially for the first couple of weeks of the month. So this is shining a light on finding the balance between your home, what you see as your security, your stability, your family, maybe your soul family, and at the same time, your direction in life. Where are you going? What are you doing? Maybe you've been feeling lost or confused. The lunar eclipse may bring something to light that maybe you haven't wanted to see, or it may galvanize you into taking some empowered action and really being the brave lion that you are and roaring and saying, yes, I can do this. So there may be a new direction in your work or career. There may be a new direction in your life generally. And you say to yourself, well, I'm here on this earth at this time of great transition. What is it that I need to contribute here? Yes, and then begin to shine. So there's an opportunity really to take off the old things, to dust yourself off and to really sparkle like a diamond. Now, on the 17th of the month, we have a change in frequency. Venus will go into the 5th on the 18th, Mercury on the 22nd, 3rd, the Sun, and on the 23rd, a new moon. All in this glorious 5th house. So this is an opportunity for you to do something entrepreneurial, to take your own future into your hands. This is the area of enjoyment. What brings you joy? What are the things that you do that you love? And how might you share those with others? And it's important to remember to have fine joy, to find that effervescent, fiery self. And these aspects can help you do it. It's great for romance. It's great for love. It's also great for romancing yourself and doing things that uplift you. That's the important energy. Mars retrograde for you in this 11th house, a few months yet. So Mars, very important time to look at the energy that you're putting into groups, community, connections, your social connections online and offline, and maybe reevaluating that in some way and looking for more ways in which you can feel as though you are being appreciated and also as though you are making a contribution. So there you have it, lovely Leos. I wish you a wonderful month. I thank you for subbing, liking, sharing, and commenting. Bye for now.